Do you need hungry? Yeah, pretty. Like, really hungry? Yeah, I'm pretty hungry. Should I order the whole menu? <laughs> no. Okay. No. okay. Hey, guys. Welcome to Oshitai. Oh, hey, how you doing? Uh, yeah, so, um, do you guys have any questions? Ready to go? Uh, ready to order? I think we're ready to order. All right, cool. Um, yeah. So I'm going to start with the um, oysters. It's happy oh. hour, so we'll grab some oysters. Um, you like oysters, right? Yeah, I'm down. Okay. Um, next, let's do probably the salmon avocado rolls. That sounds interesting. I've never had right. that okay. at a Thai place. Uh, beef wasabi roll sounds good. Good. You like tuna? Yeah, do okay. tuna. Let's do the tuna tower. Um, I'll do some pap uh, papaya salad. Oh, okay, uh, yeah. Can um, can that be? Can you just, can you just make that spicy? Mm -hmm. Yeah. You don't how, really how spicy you like it? Like really spicy. All right, cool. I'm on it. Yeah. Okay, so, mm -hmm. um, I'll do the volcanic beef. All right, I see that's, that's your good. signature. Yeah, it is. Um, the spicy basil, the the, the basil chicken. Alright, are you guys expecting more people? Because I'm that's a lot of food. Uh, no, just us. It'll be good. Okay, well, if you say so. Okay, yeah. so spicy basil. How do you like it spicy? Um, let's do like a medium. You don't, right. really, like, you don't really like spice that much, right? I don't know if we'll be able to get even close to finishing uh, that. Alright, All let's right. do, um, uh, crying tiger steak. Alright, beautiful. Crying tiger steak. Uh, you like your, your shrimp? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Angry. <laughs> let's do the angry, angry prawns. Let's do the angry, angry prawns. prawns. Yeah, good. Yeah. Yep. Um, is that really spicy? Um, yeah, we can make it spicy, but are you guys sure? That's a lot of food already. You're hungry, right? Not, not that hungry. Uh, yeah, <laughs> I don't know right. about that. You just make it like in like a medium or a mild. Okay, cool. I'll do that. Um, let's do the uh, Bangkok uh, roti. Okay. That's like green curry, right? It is green curry with cool. roti. Yeah. Are you about? To, are you gonna order the, the whole <laughs> menu? What are you doing? That's almost a whole what menu. What are we now. doing? Uh, let's do. Okay, oh, I'll just come with them. Royal pad thai. Okay. And uh, I think maybe I'll get. A, oh, let's do a, a Penang curry. Yep. So Penang curry with chicken. Okay. Yeah, chicken. Uh, chicken's a good call. Yep. And. Uh, should we get anything else? No, are you for real? What All right, I, well, <laughs> let me, let, I might, well, might get another item or two, but uh, let's let's get started on that. And uh, I think that's a good place to start. And you, you bring it all at once. All right, cool. Yeah, I'm on it. All <laughs> thank, right, guys. Okay, thank you. Okay, cool. Thank you. <laughs> cool, thanks. Are you serious? Dude, you said you were hungry. I, I'm not, I can't do that. That's you. No. <laughs> that's right. Like I said, this, this is a special occasion. So I, you've never had most of these items. I picked pretty much all the items that Kyle has not had. I'm going to see if there's one or two more you haven't had. We'll go back through this big menu. It's a big menu um, and it should be fun. So let's eat. Hey everyone, Joel Hans here, and today I am in downtown San Francisco, right by the water. Literally, the pier is right there, guys. And guess what we are doing today, guys? We are going to go deck out and have some delicious Thai food. I've been on a big Thai food kick. I love Thai. And we are at the best Thai in San Francisco, guys. This is Osha. Osha Thai. So I'm super, super excited to check it out. I'm here with my good friend, Mr. Kyle. Kyle, a local here um, in the San Francisco area, guys. So pretty much, we're going to go in. I am going to treat Kyle. Kyle has said he's never had like real good Thai food. Like I said, I know this is the best of the best. So we're gonna head on in, have some fun, we're gonna eat some food. We're gonna go big guys, we're gonna go home. Um, but I'm excited dude, so ready to eat? Let's go, let's do it. <laughs> let's do it guys, it's gonna be crazy, so much Thai food, but like I said, the best of the best when you're in the area. And uh, San Francisco is a hub for kind of like Thai food, um, all kinds of other Asian cuisine, so, and seafood. Can't forget some seafood, so let's go have fun with these food. Let's get eating. All right, everyone, so here with all the food. Definitely no shortage, I will say. Man, what do you think of this spread? Wild, I've never seen this much food in front yeah, of me. Yeah, guys, like, it doesn't <laughs> even fit. So we went all out, like I said, I had to treat my boy. Um, we have, in fact, like just over 300 bucks of food in front of us, which is awesome. Plus, these amazing looking drinks, guys. Literally, this is a friggin' drink in a coconut, guys, and I'm all about that life. All right, so uh, like I said, everybody, let's get started. I'm pumped. Um, where to start? I think probably the place to start is this lovely looking uh, steak. So the crying tiger steak, quality Kobe beef. It is cooked like a perfect medium rare. We have also in this tamarind um, kind of dip they have for this tamarind sauce, which gives it a crying tiger nature. Serve with the papaya salad. What do you say, man? Cheers. Cheers. I'm gonna try it first just by the steak. Mmm, perfect, perfectly cooked steak. It is super delicious. Dip it in that sauce. Mmm. Oh man. It is sweet. 
I love the taste of tamarind. Go be a spice shop. I've never. This is the first time trying Kobe beef for me. Yeah, guys, it is. Yeah. it's super good quality. Again, they actually cooked it like I said, absolutely perfectly. I'm super, super impressed. How spicy are we on this? Not spicy. Not too spicy. No, not spicy at all. Just flavorful. And that's what I love. We also wow. some sticky rice in here. I'm a big beef fan. Yeah, the saltiness and the seasoning. Yeah, the sauces. Sauce is good bait, right? That's something else. All right, so you gotta try this papaya salad. Mm -hmm. I love papaya salad, so I got a spicy one. We also got this as a mild. Um, so Kyle, he likes spice, but not as much as I do. So I told him, <laughs> to, I told him to make this one real spicy. So grab it, man. Give I'll it a shot. This one. So papaya salad, guys, you're not familiar. When most people think of papaya, salad like papaya like even you yourself earlier you're like yeah. you think of the very traditional like fruit that you might see in a grocery store red this is like green papaya mm. so citrusy and mm -hmm. even this one has a little bit of spice but it's not burning my face off no. <laughs> and this is good heat guys with the peanuts in there the lovely citrus super crisp wow. papaya mm. oh yeah there's those little chilies in there. Those peanuts really, they make it. It's a good flavor, right? Yeah. But I love just the crispness. Yeah. Oh, some papaya salad. Very balanced. Yeah, that's so cool that it doesn't taste like that. The normal papaya, like the inside that's super deep orange. It's kind of almost, it's not bitter, but it doesn't have like that. This has that punch flavor yeah. to it. It's, it's like nice acidity, real good. Want have an oyster? Yeah, I'm down. Let's right. do it. Let's deck an oyster. We're going to come back. So I've, they have this lovely kind of like a house-made mignonette kind of hot sauce going. So feel free to deck it on there, grab a little spoon maybe. I'm gonna take the first one. Just as just, is? Just as is. And these are coming from Washington. They're a really nice looking oyster. So cheers, brother. Cheers. Mm. Mm. Ooh, wow, wow. Okay, really nice sweetness on that oyster. Mm -hmm. The mignonette is a really, really, really nice addition. There's also the lemon. What'd you mm. think? It's, it's awesome. I'm, I've had oysters once before and the one that I had was insanely salty. These ones aren't crazy, crazy salty. I'm guessing I'm, I don't really know why, but they're, they're delicious. Yeah, so these are not an overly briny oyster. What I love, they're really nice and meaty. Kind of like sometimes those water, like warmer water oysters carry a little more meat to them. Mm -hmm. Oh man, that mignonette though is really good. It's really sweet. Really nice sweetness to it. You have to try, yeah, yeah, I'll, I'll double it up. I'll Let's try it after. Check it out. I'll deck some lemon on this one here. But yeah, kind of a cool addition. Again, I've been on a real oyster kick. I understand most people might not associate oysters with a tire shop, but mm. could you ever go wrong with oysters? Mm. Mm. Oh yeah, there you go. And yeah, not overly briny. This yeah. is my style of oyster. Really like it. What do you think of the mini net? Delicious. I had a little lemon on there with it. The lemon's good. Yeah. Like honestly, I had just lemon on that one. I'd recommend. Yeah. So, I'm gonna grab probably this one here. Yeah, I'll take another one. Yeah, these are these uh, are good. These I, are you, these are really good. You're right. The, they're so meaty. These are delicious. Delicious and a real quality quality oysters. Let's try these. Uh, we got some wasabi beef rolls here. Yeah. So it is a lovely cooked piece of beef. We have inside some cucumbers, some celery. We have the wasabi dressing the gentleman talked about. So we're gonna grab them, my friend. Going right great, for it. Great appetizer. Great shareable. Damn, looks delicious. Oh, that beef, look at that, man. The beef is cooked perfectly. Got like a medium rare on that beef. I'm going so, in. Uh, yeah, let's do it. I can't wait. Mmm. <laughs> Woo! Guys. Mmm. Fresh. The mintiness. Mm. The mint yeah. in there. Wow. So fresh. Look at that, man. It's like mint. That is Little peppers. Bit. I bet. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna try this. Oh, man. Yeah? Alright. Yeah, dip, grab, grab the... Uh, the piece of the beef, the roll, the wasabi of the dressing, it's so fresh, the mint, Woo! wow, it is just like, that is good, eh? I taste the wasabi. That wake you know, <laughs> listen, I love wasabi, that'll definitely wake you up. Woo! <laughs> That's good, right? I'm gonna have another Yeah, one. go for it, man. Yeah. I'm getting one too, I'm gonna really dip it in this sauce. Yeah, oh, good, do that. good move. Like I said, guys, just the dressing, the flavors, the crisp veggies. Wow, mm. I love it. Can't get over the mm -hmm. freshness of the mint inside that. Woo, I got the wasabi on that uh -huh. one. Man, damn good. Let's try this, um, one of this basil chicken. This looks so awesome. We got the clear broth, guys. We have that lovely, 
Lovely, lovely, lovely looking. Guys, I keep, did I say lovely enough? Freaking runny egg on it. I'm gonna come right up and show you guys. Let's get this egg break action. Guys, look at that yolk. Look at that. The orange color oh, on man. that egg. Yeah, that is such a nice, like, free range egg or something. Look at that deep yolk. Look at that just dripping and running all over that chicken. Oh, man. And then we have the Thai sauce with it. And, uh, yeah, cucumbers here. You, you wanna just dive in? Doing the family style. Let's do it, guys. Let's do it. Yeah, probably, probably a spoon, maybe? I don't really know, like, the best yeah. way to... I don't know, let's kind of get this yolk. Oh, man. Guys, look at that. That is just such a nice bite. I'm just gonna kind of dig on in here. Get some of that yolk. I'll, tr <laughs> I'll try the terrifying Thai chili sauce. <laughs> you don't have to try it. So I'm gonna grab some of this. All the chilies. I'm just gonna put this right in my mouth with some of this lovely, lovely looking chicken. Oh my gosh. Wow. Going in. Mm. Just wow. The flavors on that, you really get that basil, but that chicken is so rich. Yeah. The egg yolk just adds this like. Like moistness. You mom that yeah. mouth feel. Mm. Great spice on that chicken. That Thai chili sauce, admittedly, is pretty spicy. I'm not lying. Mm. I kind of want to find out. Go for it. <laughs> I kind of want to find out. All right. It's good. Maybe okay, don't take little. a whole spoonful like I did, but yeah, it's, it's a hard, it's sharing, it's a hard dish to, to maybe mango a little bit, but. Yep. How's that bite? You feel that like chili sauce is hot. It, it yep. kicks, it kicks, all right? They ain't joking around, but. Woo. Man, that chicken. That chicken, yeah. So rich. Super delicious. Definitely, I'd recommend. I, I, I gotta say, I think I was, I'm, 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 don't get, like, this is a great looking dish, don't get me wrong, with that egg on it, but this blew me away. This is better than I expected. So. The, the flavor of yeah. that chicken and the, the like herbs that are in here. You can't sleep on it. No. No. Amazing flavor. What do you want to try next, brother? I've been picking all along. Let's go for the green curry. Green curry, good choice, guys. This is uh, with the uh, the roti, which is awesome. Again, this just looks fantastic. We got the mint on there. It looks super floral, super fresh, and uh, oh, dude, that's that smell. And we have we have got an egg here too. We're we're on the egg gist right now. Let me try to pop this in front of us, dude. And talk about the presentation on it. I know. I cannot believe the presentation on all these items. This is honestly probably one of the most elaborate and beautifully presented restaurants or like items I've seen in a restaurant in a long, long time. I kind of want to go in for a half an egg and just- Go for just it. Just go all in. Grab that egg, man. Yeah. Grab that egg, toast that. Do you want to put a roti in the-, the, the I don't know, I'm kind of thinking of dipping. Go for it. What are we thinking? Yeah, man. Work. Man, I love green curries. That green curry paste, the coconut in there. Good. That's a winner. Yeah. Oh, all right. I might try it. I'm going to try, try buying this out. curry, guys. We got the beef in there. There's also some eggplants in here. Ooh, yeah, guys. I can see the, 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 the cilantro, the mint. Oh, my God. Man. I'm in. Oh, my Lord. The all way right. they utilize the mint in, mm. in some of these dishes is just... Man. That curry. Guys. This is one of the best green curries I've ever had. I'm gonna try with this really crispy roti. And again, this this roti is like more of a Thai style, so it's like flaky. It's more like a pastry to me. Mm -hmm. mm. Crispy. Wow, that green curry. Oh my God. <laughs> is this eggplant in here too? Mm-hmm. Woo, guys. Dude, the roti is like, it's a pastry. Yeah, it's like a pastry. It's almost like a fried bread. All these lovely layers in it. The kind of richness of that bread, along with this curry, man. Mm -hmm. And the way they cook the eggplant too is just perfect. This may be the best green curry I've ever had. Like, <laughs> mm. I'm going back in. Mm. Wow, what a flavor! Mm -hmm. Fantastic. That's probably one of my favorites. Yeah. But uh, I don't know though, because <laughs> those beef rolls, whatever you call them. I don't know. Uh, angry prawns. Angry prawns. Angry prawns, guys. Yeah. Man, those Szechuan chili peppers, I love those things. They're absolutely delicious. Um, this looks definitely, I mean, we got eggplants in here. I see some peppers. Lovely looking it. shrimp, prawns. And I am excited. Man, it's a good size of the prawns, too. Oh, yeah, they're huge. <laughs> okay, I got all the sauce. I'm gonna get some eggplant on the bite. Give us a go. 
Mm. Whoa! New favorite. Mm. New favorite. Yep. Man! Okay, the prime is perfectly cooked to start off with. It's not dry at all. It is super, super moist. And man, you really, like I said, they got the, the, the Szechuan, you know, kind of peppercorns in here. And that is, that is a flavor. The, 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 that, that, you, you ever have one of these? No. Grab the other one. Okay. Just take a bite of it. Just a whole, just a bite? Mm -hmm. All right. It is such a fresh, strong flavor. Whoa. Yeah. And that's going to numb your mouth. If I give it a minute, it's going <laughs> to numb your mouth. It's so, like, fragrant. Yeah. In a sense. But man, look at this. These peppers, these eggplants. Look how rich this is. <laughs> Guys, this sauce is so thick. Thick and sticking on that, and the angry prawns. It is just like, mmm. Well, those. It, it's so creamy. That spicy for you? Szechuan peppers. Is, Woo! Oh, there you go. <laughs> I, said, I like spice. I think there might even be cheese in this, to be honest. It is so rich, so creamy. The way that it sits on that prawn, the eggplant, the spices in there, that is just crazy. And it comes out like just bubbling. Yep. What do and, you think? And again, the eggplant is cooked perfectly. Yeah, they definitely got it down, but... The flavor of that is... I don't know if I like the green curry more or if I like that more. Dude, this is good. And yeah. like I said, you really get a flavor of that a Szechuan, uh, that Szechuan kind of a peppercorn. So oh, yeah. you, you like that, though? I like the peppercorn, yeah. My oh, mouth man. is definitely a little numb now. I like it. <laughs> there we go. Still lots of food. I think we did hit this volcano beef, though. Let's do it. it uh, or, sorry, volcanic beef. With the carrots on top... The onion rings, great presentation. So now we have this beef. Now this is what I like about this beef. So and this is in a bit of a chili oil, a chili paste. So it's Ooh. super, super glistening, super nice and shiny. You can see just the kind of beautiful sear they got on this beef. But give it a shot. Let's do it. Cheers. Cheers. I like that. It's almost sweet. It's very sweet. Yeah. Great tasting kind of beef. But, what I wasn't expecting is how sweet it is. Kyle, what do you want to try? What's well, right in front of me. We got to do the, the tuna? Yeah. Tuna tower? Let's do it. Let's do it. So we got crispy wontons. We got, I know they said the tuna. There's, a, 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 I think, some kind of aioli. A mango, too. Yeah, mango, yeah, mango on manila the mango, and avocado. So kind of a, I, I, like, I thought it would be more like a poke, but this is a really cool dish. And like, like look how it's, you know, yeah. You look. can see the mango chunks yeah. on the inside. I mean, look how it's created, guys. It's just like this, you know, super cool looking tower. That looks really good. Wow, I mean, look at the layers. The funny thing is the colors. It's like you get a red, red, yellow, green. Yeah. But yeah, yeah get, oh man, that looks like a good bite. Oh, get all the, go. uh, all the three. Getting everything and a little bit more of the mm. mango. And... Yeah, that's gonna be delicious. Yeah, <laughs> it's good. Not oh, good. That's a fantastic combination. The sweetness of the mango. Look at that bite, guys. Just look at that. Oh, that looks fantastic. All right, on a crispy wonton. Here we go. Dude, tell me about it. Mmm. Right, I'm going for another. Wow. So, I get like a little bit of like almost soy flavor. The tuna is fantastic. Super good quality. It seems really light, but you get such a richness of that that avocado. Dude, that is that is bomb. Mm -hmm. And I think it's that like the, the wonton just adds that crispy, crispy flavor. Yeah, that wonton doesn't take away from because they don't make it's not salty or anything yeah. like that. It's just a nice crunch to add to everything oh, else. I'm just gonna oh. try this bite here. Mm. Let's try something different, man. Let's try yeah. maybe these uh, salmon avocado rolls, like crispy salmon avocado rolls. So it's almost like a spring roll, which mm. is super cool. It's uh, you know, not like a sushi when you hear like a salmon avocado roll. You think of that, but it's like a little bit of roe in it. Yeah, um, there's a sauce too. If you want to go for oh, the sauce. Oh, there is. Yeah. yeah, man, dip it. Give it a dip and some kind of sauce. I'm gonna try it without it. I'll try it with the sauce. But okay. Cheers, man. Cheers. Mmm. Ooh. Great fine. Again, really fresh. And they put oh, the, yeah. the mint is in there too. I'm getting some mint. Yeah. Yeah. Or some mint. Yeah. 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 Really yeah. building. The way they utilize the mint just makes it taste so fresh. Mmm. Yeah, it is fresh. Wow. So that sauce is sweet. 
a little bit of acidity, mm. which with the richness and crispiness of the shell, really balances it out. This is delicious, really, but it's, it's really rich. I find that sauce just makes it like, rounds it out. A little sweet, rich, and sour. I love it. Yeah. How you feeling? I'm not trained for this, but uh, it's so good. There's no <laughs> I'm gonna keep going. Food. So we got the pad thai with the uh, Penang curry, which I'm super excited for. And then we have the ha soy, I believe it's called. Yeah. So this is like an egg noodle soup. We got some chicken in there. I'm not even sure what all the greens are, but it looks really cool. Some egg, fried noodles, cilantro. It looks really, looks really, really fresh and good. I love the curry so far. So uh, let's give this a bite. Yeah. Um, when that one came out, that was one of the ones. It that smelled. Yeah. It was yeah. so aromatic. So look, at this guys. As I'm mixing up, I'm realizing it's. I thought it was a lot of liquid. It's very, very um, thick. It's very, very dense. Like we got pretty much like the egg noodles in there. A little bit of chicken. Wow. It looks good though. Man, how do you? I don't even know how to describe that smell. It is so like now I get a little bit of the lime. But it's, I don't know, it's curry? Yeah, it's, it's got that it's something. Like yellow curry or curry smell, yeah. spice smell to it. I don't know. Yeah, let me just get a, get a, get a bite yeah. of all these mixed something somethings here. What are we thinking? Oh, man. Yeah? So it's like, I get the yellow curry kind of flavor, but the onions, the cilantro, and it has a little bit more acidity than like the standard uh, curry would. And... I relay that really to kind of like, I find a lot of the Thai soups have this really nice acidity, mm -hmm. a little bit of that citrus. It's a good bite. They got, they got a big uh, got a Thai chili here. Fried Thai chili, mm, so good. I'm gonna try a, uh, get another bite of this here. Kind of get a lot of reminiscence of like yellow curry. Yeah. What, what, do you, what do you get on it? Yeah, I'd say about the same yellow curry. It's not, it's not spicy at all, really. Um, Flavorful. Yeah, those wonton noodles on top are really good. They, they're really fresh. The noodles are really, really, like they're al dente and like perfect, like perfect form, perfect flavor. I like that dish. It's kind of like a, it's like a curry noodles. Yeah. Yellow curry and noodles, not bad. All right, I'm definitely, I tell you, man, I'm, I'm, I'm finishing up. Oh, I'm filling it up. This is really good, but filling. Yeah. A lot of, there's a lot in there. I didn't realize the noodles were, like, there was a lot. They said, I almost thought it was more brothy. Once you got through that top layer, it was straight noodles. Ooh. So we also have the uh, the rice here. I don't know if it's a sticky rice. I think he said it was a, a sticky rice. Yeah. Yeah. Ooh. And then the Penang curry. So in this, we got chicken. You can also get the beef one as well. Penang curry, I I'd say, is just kind of like a really delicious curry. I, I don't know how else to put it. It's simple. I like it a lot. It's going to be very similar, um, in my opinion, to probably that last dish we just had. Wow, it's full of chicken. That looks really nice and creamy. Guys, look at this. Yeah, this was absolutely full of chicken. It looks super moist. We eat that lovely cream, that curry. All right, let's give us a bite. I love, love, love curry. I'm going to go just for the, uh, just for the sauce. Mmm. Oh, man. Wow. Guys. Yeah. Yeah. That flavor. Yeah. <laughs> wow. Talk about the herbs. Like mint. I don't even know what all those flavors are. Just mint, curry. Mm. And, and the spices. It's, yeah. it's not like hot spicy, but the, the spices are... It's so complex. Yeah. And that coconut. That coconut milk like in there. Guys, I love a curry like this. Mm. It, the curries here are awesome. Yeah. <clears throat> in between. Now, between the green curry and this yellow curry. Ooh. What, what are we going for here? Ooh. That's a tough one. The Penang curry is amazing. Mm, so good. I love that spice. I don't know, man. I think I might go with the green curry, but that's only just out of preference. This is like... I think I like this one more. Yeah, it's yeah. good. I've loved everything. And the curries. And the tea. I have got another one. So good. Last but not least, Pad Thai. So, Thai favorite, guys. These are like, I think this is the most well-known Thai food. So we got the uh, noodles in here. Of course, we have the shrimp, very classic. They actually then have tofu in here, lots of peanuts. I know which, their specialty, they do tamarind and a bit of tamarindness as well. And the lime, lime is very traditional. I'll put the lime all over it. The nice bit of citrus really goes with that richness. 
of the dish. I'm gonna go in there with my hands, just grab a shrimp. Good. So that, yeah, good. Let's do that. I think it's a good place to start. I'm gonna grab a piece of some of this tofu. I'll get the noodles. Mm. I get that complete bite. Oh yeah, nice and steaming hot. Yeah, you really get that pad thai flavor you just from the shrimp. Ooh yeah, guys, look at this. Nice and steaming hot nudes. All the nudes. And then I get a little bit of this, this uh, peanut in there, the peanut action. Mmm. Wow. Talk about pad thai flavor. <laughs> Man, I really like the, the flavor of that pad thai. Guys, you're not familiar, it's such a strong flavor. We have like crispy bean sprouts, probably a great addition. I like the shrimp. The tofu is really good too, actually. It gives a, it's a really cool texture. Again, super uh, flavorful. Really dynamic flavor in that pad thai. Like that's not coming out of a bottle, that sauce. No way. There is so many different flavors, spices. I think a good pad thai sauce, I remember reading has like, just like a list of ingredients like this big. I'll tell you what though, man, I am full. Overall, dude, what did you think? I am so full, but that was... <sighs> that was an amazing experience. Fantastic. That was absolutely... The way that they incorporate the mint mm -hmm. in a bunch of the different dishes and and the... I've never had green um, green, green curry. curry. And that stuff was... So good. And along with it, what do you call it? The rotis or the... Yeah, the roti bread. The roti bread, that, that pastry roti, that, you, roti, that you have with the curry. Yeah. Amazing. I gotta say, yeah, the flavors have been yeah. exceptional. I think it's a great, great, great Thai experience. Lovely location. We're right downtown here. Hop that in here is well worth it. Definitely, I would say the best Thai I've had in uh, San Francisco in the city, guys. Um, that's about that. So I want to give a huge thanks to all the staff here. They treat us super, super well. Huge thanks to Kyle for joining me today, man. Appreciate it. Thank you. Hopefully you enjoyed your time. Oh, yeah. Big <laughs> time. This is a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity. And this guy, he's, he's an awesome dude. Well-rounded, just really awesome guy. So. I appreciate you joining. Um, favorite dish is the green curry? Uh, I'm gonna go. I'm I, I'm green curry and, and that salad, that papaya salad, just because of the shock factor of it. Yeah, it I didn't know that the papaya was gonna taste like that. Surprisingly good, yeah. right? I think my favorites. Honestly, I'm also gonna go with. Oh man! But as I look around, yeah. You know, okay, I'm gonna go with basil chicken, green curry, Penang curry, and then like, well, of course I love the oysters and everything. That was just like it was a given. You know what I mean? But I think like yeah, the the basil chicken stood out a hundred percent. Everything stood out. You know, even that the noodle dish, um, the cup, the whatever it was, that noodle dish, the, like the yeah. curry, I loved it all. What can I say? It was really, really good. So, that's about that, man. I, I totally forgot about that one. Yeah, the basil chicken. Yeah, so I'm going to have to hold on. I, so we're going basil chicken, and then we're going to go green. Uh, and the tuna. Green curry. Oh, the tuna. God. <laughs> hold on. Anyway, all right, anyway, everybody, we got to, to be honest, we're actually like, we're... We're overdoing our parking. But long story <laughs> short, uh, let's be honest, otherwise we'd probably sit here and chat a bit longer. Um, but like I said, huge thanks to everybody here. Loved it, great experience, great food. Um, I definitely recommend. They have a couple locations, like one here in, uh, of course, San Francisco, and one in Napa, I believe, as well. Yeah. So with that, everyone, until next time, of course, I happy all the hungry, happy eating. And with that, have a lovely day. Any words? Hey. Enjoy yourself. Enjoy yourself. <laughs> until next time, everybody. <laughs>
definitely a great view up here if i look behind me look at that look how vast that is that's just nuts um the actual rock face itself and that's the uh, castle rock what's up guys yeah. there are some friends but yeah like it's pretty impressive look at this big you can see this big rock face here but it's uh pretty pretty big pretty steep so don't want to fall but yeah it was cool so got some exercise today and as we further up the rock cliff you see all these caves in the big face we saw the other side kyle's climbing on up super impressive all kinds of caves apparently people sometimes camp at them and again just this insane crazy view i mean is that i don't know it's like some, I don't know, San Francisco or something in the distance. Awesome. And then another view from the top where it is very windy. Awesome, everybody. This is super, super cool. I'll try to like show you. We had this huge valley, valley two. Very, very, very steep drop. So we're right on a rock face, but be careful, but it's real cool up here. I don't know, buddy. Um, I think your tire uh, looks a little uh, a little messed up. <laughs> like uh, maybe it shouldn't be sideways. Like you might want to get that checked out, brother.